Hey guys, it's Jessie. I wanted to show you another picture of Miss Autumn. Isn't she beautiful? I'm planning on doing a plan with me, but I figured I'd have baby Autumn in the background. We did change out rooms, so you can see us in here. Um, my husband is playing a game in the foreground. You can see his leg right there. Um, so I'm going to work on a plan with me. This is my new planner. I am using an Agenda 52. It is from Hobby Lobby. I got a good deal on it. Everything was 50% um, off. And I got this style planner. You can change out the styles so you can see what the months look like here. And then average month layout. This is the average weeks. If you hear stuff in the background, it's because my in-laws are actually watching TV downstairs. Most of the pages look like this. A normal week looks like this. This is when I first got it and I was kind of looking at putting schedules in that kind of thing. This is um, one that I added in. So this is the layout one I added in extra. So yeah, so I'm gonna do one of these. I'm gonna do some preliminary planning and then I'll get to you guys. Hey guys, so I'm back. I wanted to do a nightmare before Christmas kind of theme. So I went ahead and used the skull washi I have from Dollar Tree. I also have a, a washi that was a Christmas washi from Dollar Tree. Um, I got them a little while ago, so I don't know if they still have them in stock or not. Um, but I thought the two together would make that Nightmare Before Christmas theme. I also had some old stickers for date stickers. I didn't have the number 28, but guess what? It's Thanksgiving. So that worked out really well for me. Also, the first is a new month, so I had another sticker for that. That's what I have so far. If you don't have stickers, you can always write in the dates, or you can get stamps. These stamps... I got from Hobby Lobby. You can also get them from Michaels, from different places. Of course, this isn't a paid promotion whatsoever, um, but you can get them from places like that. Or, like I said, you can write them in. Um, but yeah, so there you go there. Now I'm going to write in the different stuff I have for the week. You can also use other stamps, which I have some other ones for too. Like, you don't even have to use just Happy Planner ones. You can use other brands. Like, I got this on sale. 99 cents at one place. And even though it was originally 999 This is actually from Hobby Lobby. I get a lot of stuff there on sale. Um, you can write in what you're doing for groceries, what you're going to eat, stuff like that. Um, you can do all kinds of things in your planner. I tend to like to do, you know, what I'm doing in the morning, uh, midday, afternoon. Or sometimes I like doing, you know, what's the main focus of the day, what, um, what's something else I'm doing, that kind of thing. So I'll show you what you, I'm doing in just a moment. Hey guys, so this is basically what I end up with. This is my very simplified planning. Um, a lot of times if I want to be more fancy, I will end up putting a lot of stamps in there, but I put my, my goal for each day. Um, like I have a lot of moving the reborns around, that kind of stuff. It is a holiday week. Um, organizing their clothes, that kind of thing. Then on the second line, I have been really focusing on what I actually have been getting done. So if I need to move, sorry for being a little bouncy. Um, if I need to move something, like if I need to actually like, you know, like if I didn't get moving them done on Tuesday, then I would actually then put down here that didn't get done and then actually have to do it, you know, Wednesday and so forth. Um, and then down here, I've been trying to do like a water tracker, um, mood tracker if it's important, health, you know, like if I need to start taking my vitamins more, that kind of thing down here. Um, I do have stamps for all those, but if I really just want to get a planner done very quickly, this is the way I've been doing it. Because let's be realistic, not everybody has time to sit down and do a gorgeous planner. But something like this only takes a few minutes. Like right now, we're only a few minutes into a video and it's basically done. Um, and you can open it up and feel good about it and be like, yeah, I had a theme for the week. It looks pretty nice. And it's all done. 
So, and then I leave this area for an overall view of the week. So if I want to look at it like a memory planner, I can actually write, oh yeah, this week we had Thanksgiving with um, Robbie Kendra. We, um, we actually had a smaller Thanksgiving Thursday and then had a bigger one on Sunday. Um, I was able to move the, if I, you know, if I do accomplish my goals, I was able to accomplish these goals. That's what I write all right there. So yeah, so if you have any questions or anything, let me know. I'll give you a little look in on my little baby girl. You should do it. And that's about it. So any questions, anything like that, let me know um, in the comments. And I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.